Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Concept Tech 2018 and you are watching video series of microcontroller 8051 and this is the first part in the series of programming exercises of 8051. In this video we will take three simple programs to make you understand the programming concepts. First programming assignment is based on the data transfer instructions. Here the program is written to copy data from register to memory location or it can copy the data from one memory location to another location as well. The program objective is written here it is to load 35H in memory location 40E0H and, and copy the same data to register R2 as well as to memory location 40E1H. The program goes as follows here we are mentioning the address of the RAM where the program is written. Then the program in assembly language, its opcode and the comments. Uh, we start with loading accumulator with the content 35H and initializing the memory pointer to 40E0H. Then we copy the accumulator data to the memory location as it is the first objective. Then we copy the same data to R2 register. Then we increment the memory pointer to 40E1H and then copy the data from again from the accumulator to 40E1H. So thereby we have copied 35H into 40E0H, 40E1H and the register R2. We will start writing the program. We will write the program for 4000H. So ASM ORG 4000. Now we will write the instructions move a hash 35h initialize the memory pointer and then we will move the contents of accumulator to memory pointer. Now we will disassemble the whole code and we will check we have written instruction correctly or not all the instructions are written correctly. Now we will execute the program using go begin execution for 4000 execution completed now we will check the results. At 40E0, it is 35, 40E1 is 35, execution complete. The next assignment is using arithmetic instruction for addition and subtraction operation. The program objective is to add and subtract the content of memory location 40E0 and 40E1H and the result is to be saved in 40E2 and 40E3H. We are again starting the program from 4000 memory location. We are initializing the memory pointer 40E0H. Then we move the content of 40E0H to accumulator. That is the first operand which is also saved in register B which is uh, the address of register B is RAM address F0H. Now we increment the DPTR and move the content of 40E1H into accumulator. That is the second operand is moved in A and the second operand is also saved in register R1. Now we add the contents of A with F0H that is register B. We increment DPTR and save the result of the addition in 40E2H. So we have done the addition part. Coming to the subtraction part, first of all we clear the carry which might have generated using the addition operation. Secondly, as the accumulator contents are modified, now we have the result of the addition in accumulator. So, we take the operand from R1 to register A again. Then we do the subtraction operation, increment the memory pointer and save the result of the subtraction in 40E3H. Okay. So, this is the program for addition and subtraction. Let's check the execution of this program for addition and subtraction. We will write the program in machine code. So we are entering the address 4000. Now we will start writing the opcodes as given in the previous slide. We will write opcodes for all the codes. And then we will using disassemble instruction, we will check whether the program is written correctly or not. After disassemble, we have to type the address which is address range which is 4000 to 4015H. Now we can check all the instructions one by one. So here increment DPTR, then addition instruction, then saving the content, and the subtraction and we reach to end of the program. Now we will check the execution, we will press G and we will give the starting address that is 4000H. Pressing enter, execution completed. Now we will check the result 
For checking the result, we'll type M, we'll give the address 40E0H, where first operand is written, which is 04, second operand is 08. 8 plus 4 gives us 0C in 40E2 and subtraction gives us 04 in 40E3. Now we have the third assignment where we have to do multiplication and division operation. The objective is to multiply and divide the contents of memory location 40E4 and 40E5H and the result is to be saved in 40E6 and 40E7H. Program is written here from the address 4020H and you can see the next instruction is written as 4023H. It is because the first instruction which is move dptr hash 40E4H takes 3 bytes. So it requires 3 memory locations 9040 and E4 is the machine code or op code for this particular instruction. Right. So uh, this is how the addresses are written here. Uh, depending on the number of bytes required in a particular instructions. So the first instruction is initializing the memory pointer to 40E4H then moving the content of the external memory uh, location to accumulator then it is saved in R1 register as well as register B whose RAM address is F0H. Now incrementing DPTR takes us to 40E5H the contents of E5H are moved to accumulator and to register R2. After that multiplication operation is performed. Multiplication operation is performed between register A and register B and that is the reason the contents initially were moved in first operand in B and second operand in A. Increment DPTR moves the memory pointer to 40E6H uh, where the multiplication result is saved using move x. So we are through with multiplication operation. For division operation, we need to reload the operands as multiplication operation changes the contents of register A and B. So we move our, uh, the second operand from R2 to A, first operand from R1 to register B that is F0 and then we do the division operation. Incrementing DPTR takes the memory pointer to 40E7H and thereby we save the result of the division operation in 40E7H. Last instruction is S jump here in all the previous programs also. So basically it is to keep the loop execution of this program multiplication and division program. So we have already entered the program into the kit. So first of all, we will disassemble and we will check whether the program is written correctly or not. So we are starting disassembling from 4020 as the program starts from 4020. You can see all the instructions which we discussed in the previous slide. They are written here. Multiplication is done. We have division instruction and finally end of the program by S jump instruction. Now we will check the contents of the memory location from where we are taking the data and storing the result. So we will check 40E4, 40E5, 10, 40E6, 67 and E707 where the result is to be stored. Now we will execute the program. We will start execution from 4020H. We will press enter. Execution completed. We will do the resetting of the controller so that we can check the result. Now we will check the result by examining the memory at 40E4H. So 8 and 10, they are the two operands. 80 is the multiplication result and 02 is the division results. Thus we have checked the results of the execution. The program is executing correctly. I hope uh, you have understood how the simple programs are written and how they are executed in the kit. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe my channel Concept Tech 2018 for more such videos and keep watching this series to be an expert in microcontroller 8051. Thank you.